<laughs> so, ladies and gents, now the time has come to go into the Russian state and give Kerensky finally a chance to rule the country he loves so much. Um, I will need trains. We have armor trains already? Damn. Oh, Bruh. no. Don't do it. Why is it scuffed so already? Why? Okay, you know what? Let's get one train up and have it up there. And we don't care anymore about it. <laughs> Never, ever. Uh, what, 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 before we start the game, let's look at our standardized uh, national spirits and begin off with an unfinished land reform, which completely cucks our resources. And we, and local everywhere locally, we have very big de uh, construction debuffs. Oh boy, oh boy, that's gonna be tough. So, uh, yeah, we have a backward industry. I mean, since the Gravelt Creek, uh, we do be having a lot of uh, shit to deal with here. Memories of Russian Revol of the Russian Revolution as well. Going in next with the Treaty of Minsk, obviously, to dip out of the war, we had to do that. Uh, and we are now uh, kind of sucking German cock. And we have to, no, we have to kind of pay the German cock, you could say. And to the next one, divided military stuff, obviously. <laughs> Just big, big military debuff. Seventy-five percent plus in research cost on land dogs. My God! And the last one probably the navy. Yeah, divided navy stuff. So yeah, we are very much a divided nation in this timeline. Um, and yeah, and now it is our duty as President Kerensky to unify Russia and bring it back to its old glories. Oh my God! And there it is. All right, that's assassination of Kerensky. The so sound of gunfire rings across the capital. Alexander Kerensky, the president of the Russian Republic, was shot by an extremist. Extremist while he was climbing the steps. Uh, to the Senate House. The, uh, the killer was beaten by a an angry mob before he could make his escape. The police arrived soon and the assassins w was recognized as Pavel Gorgulov, member of the Savinkov combat squads. Regardless, the fate of Russia has been irrevocably changed, for better or worse. A shot that will ring across the world? Thankfully, the wound was not fatal. Kerensky survived. He has magically survived. Kerensky is still in power. Oh, look at how happy he is now. <laughs> He's like, fuck yeah, I survived finally. Okay, so now we have now President Kerensky. Now the time for a bright future of Russia can begin. You can change Kerensky's portrayal in the decisions. Oh, wait, really? Hey, there it is. Holy shit. Um, I mean, I like happy Kerensky. <laughs> what the fuck is the third one? A third president. What was this now? Let's get that. He's now, he's a very elite man. I was never a socialist. I was never a liberal. Find a compromise. So we can either now focus on where one party said or still follow the coalition. Very, um, I would say that we were never a socialist. Yeah, no, no, no. We will go with that. We were never a socialist. We were just playing it. The people are getting pissed. We have to, what the fuck? Oh my God. I didn't see that one. Holy shit. That looks fucking nice. Look at that. We have the president, the prime minister. That's our rule parting. It's kind of cursed. It looks kind of weird a little bit, but okay. That looks so, so fucking amazing. Look at that. Someone actually put so much effort, so much effort into stuff like this. I swear, I had like the best. I had like the best idea ever. I would, I really wanted to fucking, but I will never get there. Like, I need, first of all, some fucking cloud or something so people know me in the whole folk community. But I would really like to change Tommy K to like do um, achievements together. Like, in a way where we both start at the same time and who, uh, whoever gets the achievement first wins. And the, and to just disrespect and Tommy K, the loser is not allowed to do this achievement anymore, ever in his life. And then he has to live in the fucking humiliation that he can never have 100% of, uh, of achievements. Oh, it would be so funny. Come on, come on. I, no, I, I will never leave that. Fuck, because I'm still as well last standing. My guy has no orc as well. But he's winning it with no orc! Man, those are- No, fuck. Now someone with orc is there. We have to wait. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Pin? Oh my god, I'm so good. Easy! Let's go, we got the east! Hey, maybe this will be a fucking... This will be the, the time where the federal government will survive, actually. If the Antont moves in and helps the federal government... No, no! Why? They support the Pacific government. I hate them so much. America, we're being fucked right now from all sides. <clears throat> Hold! America. America, please. America. America. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, react America. Redeploy something. Fuck! We've been played by 10 fucking divisions! No, 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 we can still make it. They, uh, we got played by 10 divisions. We got absolutely played by 10 fucking divisions. And now they're in front of Washington. They destroyed everything! Damn, that was a good a good move by the AI. Gotta admit to that. But holy shit, why? 
I give them so much shit and yet they just did no still know how to throw the game. I cannot believe I always bet on the wrong horse in this civil war. Respect the Minsk Treaty. Compliance with the Minsk Treaty does not mean that we are weak. This will show our good intentions to the Kaiser so that we can sit down at the negotiation table as soon as possible. Gains Russia respects Minsk, Minsk Treaty. Well, we, we're gonna get fucked by that. By the Minsk Treaty again. Hey, look at that. We ju we, they just trade so much with us. Yo, Kerensky has changed again. He's now a little bit pissed off. What do we have? The eternal president. Oh, that's very fucking good. At least we have some stability fine in this country as well. Try to change terms. Ask Germany for renegotiations. Okay, let's go. The whole region should be united under Russian culture as, as was negotiated in the Treaty of Minsk. Okay. Let's try to negotiate here. Like, we're doing hell on our fucking political moves. Then I go... Germany insists on oil ownership. Let's let's do it. Let's continue. Let's... We can ma maybe ha cup, uh, hand out some deeds and do not trigger any Germans. Germans agree. Talk about uh, Transamur with Japan. Germans agree, and let's talk about Eastern Europe. The most major issue of the conference is the fate of Eastern Europe. Countries as established as German puppet states after the end of the World Cup. Well, wait, let's see what, the German, what Germany can offer us. The Eastern Europe is Russian. Okay. Oh, Germans give up by Rufinia. That's like, ah, uh, fuck. I know it's funny to join, but like, then the whole game's almost over. I have no one to fight with. I, if I want to... Look, they are on taunt this fucking week. They are weak. I will... I will... We cannot agree to this. The negotiations are failed. I don't care to be honest about it. Germans leave the conference. This marks the end of the Treaty of Minsk. Fuck. Okay. At least we can now fix some, finally something. Time to mobilize. Trash the Reichspark so we can only already go into war. What the fuck? Um, let's already though try to secure some parts of our old empire. It is gone. I have already the 50% buffs. Let's go in, boys. <laughs> hey, integrate into this country Ooh, i mean a little bit i'm a little bit scared now that um how is it say how to call it the, the russians will go against ukraine i can't do nothing about it let's leave the get the ukrainians in here let's go oh fuck uh yeah uh, you know what ukraine i think you're on your own to be honest buddy i'm it was a good run but we actually cannot help you on that one we are so not ready for oh shit oh persia Fuck off. Wait, do not join the Rakspark in the love of God. What have I done? Do not let them do that. Yes, I fucking knew they would escape. Russia, Ukraine, why the fuck are you supporting me? You are in a war yourself. Okay, very important. Um. Oh, fuck. I'm so sorry, Ukraine. I'm so sorry. Oh, we can, he can cut off them. Oh, shit. I didn't really say that one. Bodaibo. Neves. Bodaibo. <laughs> Almost reminds me about the guy who's saying Bada boy. Whee! He just goes straight down to Vladivostok. Whee! I'm so sorry, Ukraine. What the fuck, Ukraine? Why the fuck should I even be sorry? You are holding very well. You just pushed into right Ruthenia. What the fuck? Let's go, Ukraine. Maybe they will against the Reichspakt, and then I have still nothing to do anymore. Fuck. Fall of Vladivostok. Let's go. Poland declared now war on Ukraine. What the fuck is going on? Kerensky unites Russia! Surviving the assassination, Kerensky has finally realized his idea of becoming an eternal president of Russia. Dealing with all threats of this world, he managed to stay in power and continue his long... Long, uh, fuck, where was I? I lost my line. A long rule. Dealing with his old enemy in Vladivostok and bringing back democracy and freedom to the East, Far Eastern peoples. Kerensky's, Kerensky strengthened his power even more. Only under his wise guidance, the Russian P Republic will prosper. The social liberal dictator. Fate knows how to joke well sometimes. Alexander Kerensky. So, hey, what the fuck? I did not expect that one. Very nice. Uh, Ukraine just did, uh, just fucking jump behind them and fucking encircled every time. What the fuck? I don't even understand anymore. Can we really, I can't, okay, you know, let's go for the full deal. Will they accept? I don't know. Refuse? No, fuck that. Fuck you. Oh, wait. Wait. Fuck. I have not realized they are finding affection. Fuck. That's bad. That's really bad. The second Russell Japanese war, yeah, with a big, big fucking fail. But he has no nothing on his border as well, though. Ha, ah, you got shit on your border. Oh, let's go. We got this little encirclement. Let's go. The, the Russian superiority of manpower will never be fucking beaten. So, I mean, my god, my generals did hell. Um, experience from this war. Like, like there cannot be nothing said. Like, they are not very good. They have to be very good. Like, six attacks, six attack. Fucking, he doesn't have much because he didn't wasn't a war. The field marshal is very good, like. 
and then I'll very prepped for a war against German against German like those those soldiers have have experienced blood that's the important part the Chinese have no chance against us not even the Chinese forts will will even defeat us fuck that the fading sun we rubbish do we push for total we reject that terms of we want that will prevent peace for all those at war with Japan not us we accept Japan's term of peace though it will take about two weeks for the deal to be finalized we want that all of those war with Japan will accept for the deal to go through okay okay I don't care we will never land there fuck that Ukraine 700k losses what and they cost only s not that much on them holy shit Ukraine did actually is paying a fucking ultimate price for this defense but soon the boys are moving in and then we're gonna wreck them all. Curse of the Japanese Empire. Hey, peace with the Empire of the Fading Sun. We fought well and deserve nothing less. Thank you very fucking much. Was it so hard, Japan? Was it really this fucking hard? Crush the rice pack. Oh, 40 days. Fuck that, Ukraine. I'm joining a war. The second world creek. Those are all my enemies now as well, Ukraine. We are now in this together, finally. Incoming! Oh shit! Oh, that's very fucking good. Nice timing. Uh, and now I have to fix all of this shit. Take planes there, take planes there. And just move down south. Hello there. And now, we have to uh, first of all take those states before we can puppet them later. You have to take everything first. Oh, fuck. And now, we're gonna wait for the magic to happen so we can uh, do our little pop-ups. Oh my god, what the fuck having that? Oh my fucking god, we have done... We have Our fucking faction is very good. Holy shit. It is now literally almost like Cold War East versus West. More like, more or less. Um, yeah, boys. I, think, I hope... Uh, um, I mean, I had... I had a lot of fun in the stream, <laughs> and I, I just want to end it for for today. It's so it's enough for it's it's enough. I had a lot of fun, and uh, yeah, as usual, I wish you a very beautiful day. And uh, uh, yeah, there's not much to be said except uh, boys. See you to the next one, and I hope you very much enjoyed it. Uh, so yeah, as like we said, see you to the next stream, boys. Uh, bye bye.